Right then. So, I believe, unless they have changed their mind since last night, um, Johnny is playing a ice wind deck. A uh, little brew that he said he came up with uh, recently. Uh, and Jean also favouring the ice, as we said, but earth ice variant. Um, so we're going to try to play on some of the... I think Johnny's a bit more going to go for a bit more tempo plays with the sort of the wind uh, wind effects there. Jean probably be a bit more controlling um, with some of the more defensive earth-based cards. Um, I think he's running Vincent in there. Um, I think he's got Shantoto as the sort of the... Uh, wipe everything from the board effect um, whether Johnny will have an answer to that um, with wind he could well be playing um, the cadet uh, 7 which can counter that um, if it comes down to that depends who's ahead or behind at that stage as to whether that would even come up but we'll see um, which one of those will come up on top um, I wouldn't like to say as I say these are probably two of our most experienced players um, I think that's a fair comment to make. Actually, they certainly won't be uh, won't be any slouches. Um, we'll see whether being on camera <laughs> affects them. I doubt um, it. I don't know whether either of them have played on camera with any of the other games that they've played. I, I they've, don't they've think so. That blank, so. I don't think so. That's always a f can be a factor in these things, mm. but um, we'll see. Very quickly, as you can see here, this this is a uh, our lovely store, Athena Games, based in Norwich, England, and uh, we got quite a selection. That's the downstairs area with the. Uh, a uh, very wide selection of board games. There's a lot, and that's not all of them. That's, that's not all of them. It's just a single... That's that <laughs> one corner. There is all of them. Um, if you can't find it there, it doesn't exist. And that's, of course, Friday Night Magic, which is uh, probably our busiest night. So you have Magic the front, Pokemon at the back. So it's split the hall in two. That's me. Hey, where, where, where are you? <laughs> so uh, second end from the left. In the, in the, the lovely purple. purple. Pur oh, yeah, yeah. Got a purple. Brilliant. I think I won that game as well. And of course we have the upstairs room, which we don't have a picture of, but we do have a picture of our board game evening, which we run every Thursday evening. So we have quite uh, the selection of events going on here most of the time. Yes. Yeah, like I say. And as you can see, so much room. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Com uh, comfortable as hell. I, 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 I mentioned this to other people, you know, I thought GPs and things with magic and what have you, and you say, you know, where, where do you come from? Where do you locally play? And you try to sort of explain to people, oh, well, I mean, this great store, and I mean, it's got lots of space. And I don't think people ever quite understand how much space, because you nearly know, every other place that I've been to play, even when you go to big tournaments, sometimes you're really crammed in, rubbing elbows. They and, need to get so many yeah. people in. Exactly. You, you know, you lay your mat down on the table. And it'll be overlapping with people on both sides because it's just not wide enough. Yeah. Because uh, they're squeezing three people onto a two person table. Um, uh, I believe that's Gene on the r right there. Yes, indeed. Yes. And what is he playing? Uh, he should be on Earth Ice. Yeah. Got some nice uh, squall sleeves there. Nice official sleeves. <laughs> not surprising, really, from him. Yeah. I think he's managed to get some over sleeves for them as well because I found with the official sleeves they look really nice um, but they do scuff up the corners very quickly unfortunately um, so uh, I think he's got all found a way to protect them and make them last a bit longer so yeah, I believe Johnny Johnny is on ice wind I've known him long enough. I should be last, but I don't know. So he's ice wind. Ice wind, yes. Ah. So both wing ice wind, and both of them got a win. I assume. Uh, this point? Yes, yes. Looks like they both won their first round. So it's going to be a seeing which one walks away with a loss today. Yes. No surprise that it be these two meeting each other. Indeed. So. There's a dice roll to determine who actually is going to go first. It's interesting interesting decisions in this game as to whether you want to go first or not. I think something like Magic, it's generally, you, you pretty much always go first. There's there's a few circumstances where you don't, but going first is, is nearly always what, what you want to do. With Final Fantasy, I don't know that there's such a defined, defined thing. Um, the difference between one and two cards drawn on your first turn is a big, big thing when you can... Uh, you can discard so many cards early on. Um, I guess the trouble is also 
you know, if you knew what the hand was, then you could also make a better decision. But then that's why you can't do yes, that. You have to make your decisions, obviously, before you draw your opening hand. It looks like Gene's taking a mulligan here. So those five go to the bottom, new five off the top, and he will have to stick with those. And it looks Ooh. like he is going first. You got a you got someone disagreeing with you. Sibinox thinks that first is objectively better. I don't know, because it instantly make, puts you... You're giving a lot away at that point. Your opponent already knows what you have. Yeah. Going for you. It depends. Um, you, you forwards can hit the, the board first. 30 seconds into round two. Thank you, Ratch. Thank you. Um, looks like Gene's taken a very, very aggressive start here. I mean, his hand may just have been set to that, but he's discarded four, uh, four cards to put both Laguna and Squall into play. Um, and uh, Johnny is also, I think he's followed up with a similarly aggressive line, uh, just playing the Emperor. Um, two damage now coming in from Jean's, Jean's forwards, um, but Jill coming down, freezing both Laguna and Squall. Uh, it's going to slow down Jean's aggression a little bit here. Um, so Guy coming down. So has there been two damage shoved onto Johnny's side? Yeah, yeah. Incredible. He's, he's, he's going at a fast, fast pace here. Um, Guy's come down for G. Um, Johnny playing Aerith, getting to untap uh, Jill. Gene's going to get access to choice forwards again now. Uh, Johnny's offering the trade for Emperor and Guy, which happens, but there's two more points of damage coming in. Ding dong! This is going at, this is going at a well, breakneck it's, it's speed lightning here. Lightning pace, but I was playing lightning. Uh, <laughs> oh. and again, no backups from Gene, he's just all aggression this game. Put down White Tiger. And I don't know whether Ice Wind again can just come back from this. There's no sweepers. Um, Two minutes in, and we could be halfway already through the game. So that's Balthier, uh, eight thousand forward. Um, but with with the Gunner and Squall buffing each other, uh, it's just too big. Um, he's taking the block here, and then activating. Uh, he doesn't have haste, I don't think. So I don't know if he could for now do that. Oh, it's always it's he's up to six. <laughs> but I don't think it's going to matter anyway. No, nope. unless he can do some significant blocking here. That's a bit. This is incredible to see two players very experienced know exactly what they're doing, just playing at breakneck speed. They know exactly what's happening. Yeah, yeah. It's incredible. Can tell their their experience with the cards, know what they do. Um, so we've got another emperor down. Um, he's going to be able to block, but. Uh, Gene sensibly goes for the party attack, meaning that he will get to keep one of his forwards. Uh, Johnny choosing to take out the White Tiger to see, but uh, Squall still around. And is Gene got another forward to pressure further on the next turn? Looks like discarding Atomos. He's finally getting a backup into play. <laughs> <laughs> right, so Johnny survived that turn. How long can he survive, though? He's played his own White Tiger to see, but that's not going to be big enough to block Squall profitably, I don't think. Or is he only a 6k? Actually, he's only 6k, so 6k against a first strike 6k. Um, Gene might have the option to use his backup. If he's got more Earth cards in his hand, he could break his backup to... And that's exactly what he's going to do. He's going to give it Brave and plus 2,000 power, I think it is meaning that Johnny can only just throw his card in front. And he's got his own Emperor now, so that's two lethal threats. Um, and Johnny's just not able to make anything stick. No. It's... Um, that's that's going to buy him another turn, though, because if Renoa dives in front of one of these forwards, it will then force the other one to dull. So he's clinging on. <laughs> just by a threat. I just barely. see how he's going to actually... Um, do anything other than just keep throwing forwards under the bus here. As McNugget says, he could stabilise the board if Gene doesn't keep drawing gas. That's true, if he, if he stops drawing forwards. Um, but uh, he's not getting rid of any of the forwards that are happening at the moment. Um, I think, can he even play two forwards here? But, so he's tapped two, he's gone four for that, but yeah. Yeah, and it's all over. Game over. <laughs> yeah, just the aggression from Gene, just too much. Johnny could not play from behind. 
just oh, absolutely see. came in oh. and steamrolled. Side. Rather sad. I keep, I keep, <sighs> uh, I keep getting those mixed up. <laughs> so yeah, just going back to the going first or second thing. Um, I mean, if you're an aggressive deck, I think yeah, you probably do want to go go first and get on the board first. Um, but the extra card can can really stack up if you. You know, if if it's a slower tempo game, you know, when both players are trying to build their boards up, they get the backups down. Um, that extra card can can really make a difference in the long run. Um, it, it limits what you can do on the first turn, your options for what you can even play. Um, yes, there's something to be said, as you say, for an aggressive deck just wanting to get forwards down, but you can get punished depending on what people are playing. You know, if they can just bounce your forwards back to your hand, um, you're just going to be down cards and no way to. Uh, to go from there. So we're already ready for game two. Looks like Johnny is going first this time. Makes sense given the aggression that Gene Shu in the in the first game. Gene did make a good case for going first actually <laughs> results in you winning. Yes. But uh, we'll see if you can keep yeah. that if that can uh, go true for Johnny. Yeah again Johnny slower start just getting a two cost backup down an archer which can be useful if uh, Gene has any uh, backups that uh, Johnny wants to take out later in the game. Uh, looks like Gene is, is going aggressive again, discarding two cards, putting Vincent in a play. Um, I mean, it worked last time, and I, like I say, I don't know whether Icewind has the tools to catch up um, if it gets too far behind. Um, Vincent is a particularly difficult one to deal with because you can't break it with anything that doesn't deal damage. Um, and again, Icewind doesn't have that many damage dealing effects. Um, so, Johnny here. Uh, okay, that looks like a Titan or a Golem to save Vincent. So, he blocked uh, and then tried to use a Mumba to deal damage to uh, Vincent equal to his power, less uh, 1000 less than his power. Um, but I think he discarded a Vincent and. Uh, I can't quite tell whether I think it's a Titan, so that meant that Vincent would not break this turn and just uh, killed the backup. Nuggets asked, did he discard Matus the Corrupt? Um, no, it's Solera. It's the other summon, I believe. Because Mateus could take out Vincent for up nice and cleanly, but I believe it's Zalera, which uh, can break dull forwards. Uh, yeah, as in Perishable Night, I said it's Solera, so it makes the uh, prime numbered dull forwards, which uh, Vincent is neither prime nor can he be broken uh, by something like Zolera. Uh, Genesis has now come down for Gene. Um, Johnny's got a blocker, but it's smaller than anything on the other side of the field. Uh, well, it's the same size as, as Genesis. Um, and you're incentivized to block Genesis anyway, because when he hits you, um, he deals. Uh, he makes you discard a card. Well, it's like it's going squarely within Johnny's uh, Gene's favour. Is is against Johnny. Johnny is losing this very badly, and when less than nine minutes into this, it's yeah, it's a breakneck speed. Again, as you say, Ice Wind once it gets behind, does he have the tools to catch yeah, up? Yeah, I think that that may well be. I mean, if if Gene knew roughly what Johnny was on, he may well have just gone. Look, I know that. That ice wind can't catch up. That's why I'm just going to say I don't worry about backups. I'm just going to put down powerful forwards and you know start pushing. Yeah, see that you can't answer them, and that that's exactly what's been the case. Um, he's now got Deleter down, one of the one of the powerful new cards out of Opus Three, nine thousand power forward. Uh, if it's targeted by a summon, you have to take a damage. Uh, the opponent has to take a damage, <laughs> and uh, if um, if it's targeted by a character, then that character has to break. So it's very difficult to get off the field without losing something. Um, Johnny used again using the tactic of just using a Renoa as a chump blocker to dull everything, save a turn. Gene adding Jill to the board, but uh, he seems fairly content and comfortable with this position. Yeah, he's 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 well ahead. Um, so Gene. It looks like uh, two of Jean's forwards got dulled, uh, frozen there. I don't know if that was uh, what what caused that. 
exactly. I know Johnny discarded a, a gel. Um, Death by a thousand cuts. Death by a thousand cuts. Uh, she <laughs> just dulling down the only blocker. Okay, well, there is Jill coming in. Ah, uh, okay. So Johnny played a Jill. Because it targeted a deleter, he had to break it immediately. So that's why it went straight to the break zone. Uh, and then he did the same thing again this turn. Played Jill, froze uh, Vincent and deleter, but instantly, because it targeted a deleter, has to go to the break zone. So again, it's just... Oh, playing Gene, just keeping the pressure on. Yeah, so he's got... Three forwards now. Those are gonna untap this turn, um, and just the one blocker, which isn't. It's just gonna have to throw itself under the bus, I think. Here with three forwards, uh, if it's even around, and it's not gonna be around. And there, it's gonna make it deal damage. Here comes in for six and seven. Seven. And that is. That it. is it. That is. Wow. Wow. That went 11, super quick. 11 minutes is how long that took. Yep. Yeah, um, it, 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 it's not pretty much over. It is over. Yeah. <laughs> it's, well. And they could play a third game for funsies, but I'm not sure that's going to change much. <laughs> 48 minutes left on the clock. Wow. 48 minutes left on the clock. Wow. Um, should we get them in here? <laughs> yeah, yeah. If they, they want to come in. And, All right. Should just see what they say. And like I say, I mean... See, maybe see a bit more of Johnny's deck because we didn't really see what it could do there. No, um, I'm gonna the chat I'm, saying it, it doesn't look like it has much synergy. Um, see what, see what he's got. Right, I'm gonna go downstairs and get myself a drink. Would you like? Uh... Uh, I'm good, thank you. All right, and I'll bring them through. Excellent. So yeah, that went went very very quickly. Um, yeah, I say uh, Johnny's deck. Uh, he said it was a bit of a brew. He's tried to put some things together. Um, and uh, we clearly didn't get to see much of it there. Gene just took the approach of being aggressive with powerful powerful earth and ice forwards. Um, didn't didn't want to play the backup game at all. And um, I think you can do that when you've got no fear of it going wrong. You know, if you're playing against earth and you run into a Shantoto, that's just game over for you because you're just too far behind. But if he knew there was none of that going on... Um, then, then it's uh, yeah, a lot stronger position. Hello. 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 Uh, I'll go back. Yeah, that's okay. Okay. Yeah, go wherever. Um, so. I will try and work out how to put <laughs> booth cam on. Here we go. Hello. 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 Um, that was over very quickly. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I was unexpected, to say the least. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. So, what was your take on it? Uh, well, maybe I had quite a d defensive deck, so I knew if I'd given time to build those up. Then yeah. we'll feel that when we get, get past it. So I didn't really draw a defensive hand in the first game as well. So like, right. I haven't got any backups. I think I got one backup. It was like a three cost. So I was like, just pitch hand, beginner scroll, and just start from there. And the next game, pretty much the same. Didn't really draw a, a slow hand. So it's start punching away. Aggressive, yeah. yeah. I mean, it, 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 it looked like it paid off. I mean, yeah, it definitely worked. Just without, there's not really any catch up spells. Not too many. No, there's there. a couple of. Like combo pieces, but they usually require something to be out on the field. So this is it. Yeah, it's a bit of a slow death. So it's something to think about. We know it was a bit of one. Yeah, that's something. Yeah, I mean, yeah, she ended up sort of just being <laughs> one time uh, yeah. fog yeah. Yeah. <laughs> by your turn. Um, but yeah, it just looked like you couldn't get anything. Couldn't anything, anything down. Couldn't it set up. Yeah, to yeah. come back into it. Yeah, yeah there can be good things, just not in most, not in that much ad yeah. Someone else scared of coming in, but Genesis as well, just to kind of like just hard. <laughs> Yeah, it's just, to, just like stops you going to play as much as you need to play to yeah. stop it. And, yeah, yeah, yeah. We had a bit of a ch debate in the chat about going first and second. Mm. Um, I mean, clearly choosing the option to go first yeah. in there when you so was the plan to go aggressive from the from the offset then and um, you chose to go first, or it was it just depending on the hand I got really? If I drew like kind of two cost back up, so I'll probably try to get a few others down, mm. but it, it'd be because I had like the beginner's squad combo and I got. Two of each in the deck, so right. it was, uh, it's one likely it's gonna, it's gonna, gonna see them otherwise. Yeah, so I was like, yeah, it's gonna get us out. Um, it's usually a good for first time play, really, because it gets over two cards and you've got about nine Ks, and that can be quite hard to stop. Yeah, yeah. So it's my deck until I get Maria, I tend to top out about eight K, so yeah, that's the yeah. game why I put Maria in to find out what happened. Didn't see her, no, no, didn't and see her. 
Yeah, unless you're playing against something that's got either a bounce or some kind of board wipe. Yeah. You know, against yeah. Earth, that's, you know, they just, well, yeah. probably yeah. not Shento on turn one, but yeah. with no backups, that's. that's fair way through Shento Toes because I wasn't expecting to get like a field where they'd have to um, have more forwards. So yeah, so definitely. Have to pay things like Titan to beat them and stuff. Yes, it's kind of. Yeah, very well today, it's my death, unfortunately. Yeah. Basically. Yeah. Friend of Windows, because yeah. I was tr- we're trying to work out like a Windows deck. Yeah, um, we both had the. Very similar one, because it's got a lot of defensive things, and if you can get, like, I think. Look at the air if. Um, yeah, yeah, if the White Hydra. And if, probably Emperor, if yeah. you get those three out, it becomes quite a hard little. Uh, yeah, it's lock soft, soft lock yeah, on, lock. on the options yeah. that people yeah. can do, yeah. Yeah, Are you was... running um, Dorgan in your... Uh, no, but I did until recently. I checked them out. My main removals are... Or Mumba and, Bar- Mumba and Barbara see a pair of various things like the First Strike and White Tiger or the Balthia, which okay, I didn't yeah. think I saw at all to deal with the last bit of damage. Yeah, so. yeah. I mean, you, you almost got the, the Mumba thing going there. <laughs> almost. It was happening at the time. Yeah. Yeah. That was an interesting choice. I could have let it through because that is, um, I saw in hand, which I thought about playing beforehand in case of the title, I thought... If I wait too much, I just don't know how tempo well, it is. So this is it. You, you have to yeah, go for it and hope. I think, yeah, you're sort of playing from behind. So yeah. Yeah. Just, there's a nice team as well. So with Sumner, um, or not sure if you're going to use it or like discard to use it. Either way, I don't have much on hand. So yeah. yeah, unfortunately, oh, yeah. I don't know how well you hear us. Hopefully, well. Right. <laughs> have you had any? Quiet. I don't know. I can't move a chat from here, so someone else can. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Iron Opus 2 Van Combo with Jill the Bat. Uh, I am not currently, no. Mm. It is something to think about. I don't know much Van, which is possibly one of the reasons I didn't think about it, mm. but uh, yeah, it could be fun. Keep, keep and Finn's frozen to be more interested. Especially with the new um, the Wind uh, one where it does 2,000 when it enters, so you can yeah. come off with like Van yeah. Ophelia quite well. Yeah, um, after a bit of no, damage. Yeah, yeah that be fun, help stop the Atrodets. Like, yeah. Finn's Love and Renoa were put in to help me against the Atrodets, and the first draft of a deck didn't even have Renoa, so yeah. I did a bit of testing on Thursday, and Finn, I came up against Type 0 deck and just dropped wiped, so it's like, I need these cards. Yeah. It's been a Type 0, I do want to say, I dropped a bit of Salira against oh, a Type 0 awesome. deck. I wiped out four forwards, yeah, and traded with another. <laughs> just Renoa yeah. Salira was kind of fun. Yeah. So, yeah, it can do good things, just... Needs a bit more anti adro tech. Yeah, yeah, Possibly going to be see. ice after. Because technically it's a similar list. Just yeah, so you should know, so <laughs> you know, so be adro that day. <laughs> a smash of earth for things like Titan and Delia and Rabban Atmos for, for direct yeah. removal. Um, Shantojo for board clear. Yeah. Um, Vincent for more like hard to kill stuff. Yeah. Um, works pretty well. Yeah. Ice does seem to be a powerful. Yeah. Element of the moment, so yeah, so sort of during the week, your your mono ice deck, mono ice deck, just, yeah, just take everything yeah. apart. It's probably luck with that one that they weren't really using guy because yeah. in that deck, I didn't have much to kill the yeah. guy unless yeah. it attacked. And I suppose, yeah, they yeah. just sit with it on defense, yeah, because yeah, a lot of time things were like seven eight thousand. Um, so it's more just trying to get sort of past them and not actually break them really, yeah, mm. yeah. <laughs> So, uh, take it, your deck went better in the first... In the uh, first, in the first right? game, yeah, 2-1 against the Type 0 deck, like I was saying. The first game lasted about 40 minutes. <laughs> yeah, <it was> <laughs> so, it was 40 minutes, and I think I had a board about 8 forwards by the end of it. So, it was just locking it down until I could get the damage through. Yeah. And third game, I actually went out though, in the last one. So, second game, King just kept punching me in the face. King is... King is... Tin did a thing, yeah. Yeah, yeah and so I, you just, they just displayed, and you just... Yeah. Can't. I moved it in the end, but it was too it's late. So big, didn't you? Yeah. Yeah. But now, third game, I went to the Adro, kept the moving things, kept turn, but yeah. yeah. I think there's definitely something there, but it needs a bit of a change of everything to be able to handle the Adro better. Mm. Yeah. They've a few things that aren't doing much. My demon possibly about the Duna didn't do much in any of my games. Mm. I'm playing the Duna and the Opus 1 Legendary Scroll, because okay, yeah. this is in the Finn, and then that's anti Adro, mm. anti small fin swarm. Yes. Which yeah. I've done before to much amusement. <laughs> I thought using that. Um... Squad again because with like Duke and Maria becomes an 8k, which in Wind Ice is very better, terrible. It's not going yeah. to die to a breeze. Um, <laughs> or like to just so anything. A bit and more survival, especially if you can protect it from summons as well. Yeah, which is it's like, easy to do in Ice. Yeah. Ice has a lot of defensive things right now, which is it has the old Ice Summoner, it has yeah. the new White Tider, it it's has in, Terror, which is in the previous one. Yeah. So Terror just increases your opponent's arm by one. Mm-hmm. So I think 
on Thursday, I got someone to play 13 for Bahamut. Yeah, me. <laughs> yeah, it was you, which may not airlift, I think, still. Yeah. <laughs> I kind of tried to use two um, like, soldiers in my, my fire list, and the, f- the first one tried to kill, like, your Emperor in your vein, yeah. he summoned um, The second one, I think, tried to pay, like, 13 to kill another two, and yeah, you yeah, left, so. yeah. yeah, that felt bad. But I think, else I can yeah. do. If it ever gets heavy control, a wind dice list will do very well against it. Just mm. If you're against heavy control, you even have the V2, the, uh, the Opus 1 there, which can start to mill. Hero. Oh, the hero, yeah. sorry. Yeah, yeah, they slow games. Yeah, yeah. So you yeah. I, ne- I nearly did mill out the first game, but then she eventually traded into the Noah and just went ham from there. Mm. But yeah, it's, yeah. It's, all the it's all interesting games. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, Ooh. blink and you miss it. Yeah, I mean, those <laughs> were both quite fast players as well, yeah. so we, we did say it after the game as well. We did comment on that saying, you know, two very highly experienced competitive players <laughs> yeah. just uh, going at it right there on the yeah. table. It was amazing to watch. <laughs> and of course, it was not really long to watch. No. <laughs> um, yeah. Because you, of course, were playing control, and if you can't control yeah. your opponent, yes. then yeah. you, you yeah. can't but catch up. Whereas... It's kind of the interesting thing in Final Fantasy. Control it can go add road quite quickly. Like, your yeah. dead is technically it's like all control. Defensive control, yeah. yeah with but things that are hard to kill. If you need to go add road, you can sometimes. Yeah. So. Turn one, ditch your hand if you want to. Yeah. It's yeah. Yeah. So a nice thing. Yeah. yeah. Keeps it flexible. Yeah. Mm. It looked like Delita did... <laughs> kill two playing, jills yeah, kill, please get it please yeah. initially we sort of blinnissed it and it's like oh, how, how are they frozen and there's, there's, there's <laughs> nothing there, there. Yeah. No, the yeah. chat was confused as well yeah so, <laughs> did it the next so time, I know like, ah, yeah. right, okay. yeah. it was like I do not want to leave to come back I should play the second one yeah. yeah, which I got lucky in Dawn. I'll admit that was the top deck but it was just like yeah. I'm slower to leave it down for a turn yeah. I'm trying to find the farm no the vein even yeah. You really want to be doing that to push through rather than playing defensive particularly against also I think I'm out of that. It turns out it has a weakness against Fortos because I have things like the Salira, yeah. 2, 3, 5, Vayne for 5. Fortos, Fortos not Fortos much. Fortos tend to be like yeah. the sweet spot as well, so. Because of things like Zero, yeah. yeah. So I think that's something else. And there's also to things like. Um, possibly Door Engine come back in. <laughs> Seymour is seeing a plain oak because it kills some. Yeah. Key some small small cost. things, but yeah. yeah. Uh, Black Mage, the new one, which is active free cost. Yeah. So there's more removal for little free cost things. Cracked back earlier. Uh, what oh, do you Anything good? King Tycoon. Thoughts on King Tycoon? Yeah. Oh, that's the one that searches, searches for it. I haven't really looked at those yet. Yeah. And how they work as a. The told us is like the Famous wants to be in a, a fire water deck, so you're already never searching for the Famous, basically. Yeah. yeah. So is Leonard good enough to just search for? Probably not. Because when you play a free water forward, is it for like two or less? Uh, can we get up a Lena, please, so we can see a Lena. L E double N A. Yeah. You can reanimate. Five cards, you can play oh, two. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So. And, and then yeah. the the wind wouldn't be my choice for a Lena deck either. Like, do you want to do possibly ice again for more of the animated goodness? So that's yeah. a tin, tri- tin tycoon. So yeah, it's a bit. It's a searcher, so always keep an eye on searchers. I think it's yeah. a general rule. Because if a good Faris yeah, or a good Lena. It's got an it's expert. So, so you yeah. could run three of them in the deck, like in a, a, a really fire water deck, and just not even play it. Lena's or Faris's. Yeah. Does Faris have a special? Uh, she has something else. She searches for a silver, I remember. That's it, yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> which is a new Sith yeah, Trust, which is, good, which is why she wants to be in a fire water. She has yeah. one in the Ethbert, so it's yeah. quite nice. And a Lena. I do want to build a deck around Lena, but again, I don't think it'll be a Tin Titoon. It'll be a, some kind of reanimator. Probably Water Ice, because it has the Devout still, so you can ditch Vins. Yeah. I didn't even just stop in the back. Yeah. If you're playing Time Mage, yeah. if you, you presume you want to bring back something that's mm. good into the field effect, then yeah. you can use Time Mage to react. It's good synergy with um, the Ephemeral Summoner, because you can play that and the Ephemeral Summoner, put like a Leviathan W deck, and then that will yeah. F- yeah. put him off for a turn. Um, yeah. But apart from yeah. that, I think there's some potential at least, mm. something to mess about with. Yeah, because yeah. it becomes like a, a 3 cost 7k, which isn't terrible. Yeah. Basically, yeah, but it's it's better than a free cost seven because it does get some back and go yeah. rate, which is better than just playing some for free. Because a lot of the playing for free, high costed, yeah, devout into it, really. yeah, yeah. I thought devout which can do it more can things, special. Yeah. So yeah, I think it can see something yeah. definitely. There's some decent water forwards, two cost Gordon and Tatnaz are the top first two I think of. Seedor. Seedor. No, two cost or less for the first ability. I mean for like um, supporting uh, for, like yeah. lots of things. Yeah, that is a way to actually get Seedor ability yeah. off on your opponent's turn. One of a few ways. Yeah. yeah. I wanted Seal Door to be doing that. Just... for that as well. Yeah. That would be quite cool, actually. <laughs> Water Fire should be a thing. The Phoenix, the Femmel Summoner to Leviathan after the attack, and he's yeah. like, about it. And oh. you get. Like, plus a thousand or first, first like. 
2000 first title wave, I think, or the Theodore effect. Like, Theodore seems like it's almost it, but not doing it in your opponent's turn limits yeah, it. And not doing it at instant speed, but it limits it. Hmm. Yeah, and it's only water, so if yeah, you are yeah. a two card deck, half the things are going to trigger it. Yeah, I did yeah. try a mono water, like that was one of the first decks I built, and it was fun. Hmm. But yeah. Theodore still did Maybe nothing much. Mono water, I mean, yeah, I tried building one. Um, it did okay, I think, I remember. Yeah, how well it worked. Theodore <laughs> did trigger a couple of times, but I don't think yeah. it was ever relevant. Yeah, yeah. So so it's it's basically just a 4 cross AK, which isn't yeah. bad in water, which doesn't have many of those, actually, mm. think about it. Most of the 4 costs. Oh, water. It's both water tapes, that's a lot. T just usually is, but not always. Hmm. Yeah. Should we crack another pack? Yeah. Well, as, we're, as we're cracking that, quickly go into the game quickly. Yeah. Um, were you intentionally not bringing out summons or uh, backups because you just want to keep press the attack against uh, Johnny's deck, or was it just because you didn't draw any relevant cards? Definitely to keep the uh, the pressure on, um, and partly didn't draw the relevant ones, but then towards <laughs> like after a few turns, I started to draw the backups. But the forwards that I want to get down and not discard them to, to play the backups. Um, so that's why I decided three, I think, to play the deleter because I knew that would be harder for him to deal with than the may have a mm. backup down. Um, especially when we've already got like two, two forwards down. Um, yeah, that's what adds to the, the pressure, really. Once you start to turn home, you have to try and keep the pressure up, otherwise, yeah. you just get out of resource. So. So if you start your down, whole yeah. hand and your opponent's got a lot of trouble backups down, they can start being more efficient. If yeah. you let that go on too long, yeah, it, they will just turn the tide and head to yeah, some games like that. The chat was saying, like, you know, if you've yeah. run out, start running out of gas, then maybe yeah. you could get back into it. But, yeah, yeah, you yeah just it was almost happened. I think as I got towards like f five or six points down, I think there was yeah. a couple of turns where I had to like play back so nothing else I could do. Um, <laughs> That's still not bad. Just, right. I still put the pressure on, yeah. Yeah. So What's in the pack? Yes. Right. Oh. No night. That works really well in ice water standard units. Try it out, and that becomes a, a two cost tango first strike yeah. most of the time. Definitely goes into a standard unit deck, which yeah. water can do. Because yeah. even if it gets up to like a sit seven table, that's still. It's a water version of Dark Knight, um, yeah. but it's easier because you haven't got to be on six damage to make it good. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So you just run out your backups yeah. and then smash that out. Yeah, if standard units see play, battle see play. Basically. That Mamza could be good as well because obviously playing around lots of backups. Yeah, yeah. water lightning and standard units. Yeah. Yeah. They're doing sy synergies. Semblance of a Gunslinger. Uh, I want to try him, but... I want to say deals... He competes yeah, with crucial people. When he deals people. damage, you can uh, choose a dull forward and do a five action. Mm. Yeah. Which is, uh, I guess, the idea being, you know, you're yeah. dulling things. And he's it's a four-to-state taste, you, though. You, you, it's good, though, because you can have more than one, because the... Legend has the same effect, but for 7,000. But true. with those, you can have more than one, so you can potentially hit something for You'll 10. Do mm. a party yeah. attack on both. Yeah. 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 Which could be yeah. quite a good one. as well, so yeah. Yeah, I saw it in the first round. Um, yeah. Next death with, with some mannequins. Yeah. Doing some work. I thought he has at least one dude mannequin, so. Yeah. Precious Leaf is still dead. Yeah. Sink. Awesome card. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Not really in Type Zero, though. Mm. She's just no, a general fire tower. More in, like, yeah. In my opinion, yeah. Force and Seven to block is amazing, like, being able to choose your removal like that will be really good. Yeah. And she can do it herself on her special, so. Yeah. Very true, very true. And even in uh, Fire Ice, you can get something to block of a Noah. Yeah. To death with the damage. Get Omino um, killed to kill their stuff on their turn. Yeah. It's one of the things when you tap with a Noah, usually it's just one damage. I just want to try it in um, Mill Deck with Sid. <laughs> just like, <laughs> yeah, again. Attack, kill stuff, Mill 2. So, yeah, a lot of potential not options. Just, but it could be fun. Yeah. yeah, just like, yeah. A lot of yeah, options, just not really type zero. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I want to put uh, Windrake. Yeah, both like, like, yeah. Awesome. Yeah. yeah, bounce both. Yeah, like four in the one card. <laughs> Just keep, keep, Five in one card. It'll yeah. work, I'm sure. Uh, Dance, uh, 3004. Potentially really good. Um, yeah, I, I think it counters like, like this should go bears when our Zande counters so much stuff. Forward, uh, it loses all abilities and so I'll just dull it to do that. I mean, yeah. very easy to kill. Yeah, yeah. that's done with a problem. Well, it's a standard unit though, so could get. That's only five sips. Right. Yeah, I guess you've really got to have something that you know. Yeah, you possibly in the water earth dead where you can protect it with things like Titan mm. already, but mm. apart from that, it's just going to be a bit too small. Yeah. Uh, Leonara. EX back up. Search you can something. search for your Palom or Porom, I believe. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So potential the fire water. Anyone managed manage to make a Palom Porom water deck? I actually <laughs> did. Like, I think just before episode three, I was playing a pa Palom Porom deck, and there's a couple of games where I did like the last point of damage using um, yeah. Comet. Because not expecting it, and yeah. you can attack with like enough to get six, and then you just go comet, and they can't really yeah. stop it. Yeah. They've got 
Both got new Druid cards as well. Yeah. Like the Palom, Palom's yeah. fire, isn't it? I'm, I'm Devon Twins. Palom's fire, Palom's yeah. water, yeah. The new Palom will see play again, just, just increasing true. down to a 1,000 is really yeah. good. Yeah, yeah. And that was everything to trade up, good basically. Well, it's all... All forwards. All forwards take yeah. so, so seven speed eight, eight speed nine, so everything can trade up. Yep. Go up as well. Yeah, every, yeah, everything trades up. So if you're playing like a if you're bird play- deck and playing for it, then that yeah. can work oh, really yeah, effectively. Oh, yeah, because it doesn't increase the power. So. Yeah, yeah, just increases the damage, so yeah, literally yeah. everything trades up. Yeah. 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 So, no, I'm going to say in water fire. It's nice to really have to searcher. And again, searchers are always going to be something to look out for. Yeah, okay, yeah. DX. So. Yeah, so yeah. You, you run free of it and you not don't feel bad. Exactly. Uh, Cloud had him earlier as a shiny. He's yeah. good. Thoughts on this Cloud? Really good. Like he, play this above in draft, he was like a game winner for me anyway, just because he was pretty much a 9k attacker. Because yeah. um, using it with, with the ice, um, Deep Grand Soldiers, who were, were, Oh, yes. Yeah. Seven. Yeah. Uh, so he was just like hitting away, and if they didn't block, then just, that can threaten the next guy attacking. So pretty much all your, your field has the threat of yeah. a 3 plus. 2000. Yeah. Um, yeah, it's a lot of surprising cards with FF7, which you may not yeah. realize unless you play the whole compilation, which I'll admit yeah. I haven't. Yeah, there's Genesis as well yeah. was there. Yeah, so, so I thought he was an to like. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Kind of yeah. Things. yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Definitely, nice. but definitely a cloud if you're playing like cloud anyway. Oh, yeah. Like it's the best cloud, yeah, which isn't like the cloud. best other cloud, yeah. And yeah. it's actually and, Yeah, and if you already have a light, it's still good. Yeah, so. yeah. makes sense. Uh, summoner two cost potentially pressure. really good allows you to play a six or less summoner it's a cheaper effect than the yeah. and you have to pay for the, the, the cost of the lightning one but then it's a free effect I think yeah. that one it's easy to get down but they have to pay for the effect so it's, yeah this one's, so being a two cost backup probably makes this better cause yeah, yeah. It's better early. On one or two one. of them turn one yeah, yeah and then Towards the end of the game, we will put down your and stuff discard a card yeah I think there's definitely to be a fun summoner deck yeah. Yeah. especially as yeah. more Six costs uh, are brought out because at the moment it's only soldier, so that adds like another element of yeah. in, into earth, which you're not you, you, you're normally able to use. So mm. we saw that earlier on, cast Atomos. Nice, yeah, so yeah that's pretty fun. It's only one reduction, I suppose. Yeah, that's just but, a little reduction. You know, better than nothing. Yeah, came from nowhere. Uh, a foil berserker. Potentially good. Three cost AK is always yeah. good to be looked at. If you want to do Andro Earth, how strange that sounds. Yeah. I think in Earth, it's definitely got potential because it can. Be over nine k easily, yeah. and you have lots of combat tricks. So it'll be a threat, like yeah. the um, Red S was, because he'd just be attacking every turn, and they it's kind of all, a weakness because they're aware it's going to be attacking, but it's also a strength because it's going to attack, and it's yeah. not like you're going to yeah, play not. conservatively. Yeah, yeah exactly. Basically, it's going to go in depth, so it doesn't care about having to attack most yeah. of the time. Yeah, they. Like- they're not going to be like, oh, while you're attacking, <laughs> you're going to trick. Yeah. They're going to yeah. be, oh, he has to attack, so I'll yeah. just make this sensible block with my 9k and then yeah. put a few planets. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Sephiroth. Mm. Uh, yeah. Search for Dark One when it dies, isn't it? Yeah. It, so. it could be bad. If it played to the field, it might be, it would actually be really good. Yeah. But because it just searches your hand, it's bad because if you play it, well, then it has to dive then to get. Dark one to your hand, which yeah. you then have to play it live for a turn to actually be able to use its effect. Yeah, because you would play it with a four cost yeah. frame one, but if you've got yeah, the four cost already down, hit X burst, yeah. yeah, you can destroy a backup pretty much instantly. But that's, that's not even that bit of a fin, no. there's a lot of fins. Well, this so. is the trouble, um, there's better ways to kill backups, yeah, yeah, that or archer if you want to pay for it. Really slow, yeah, he's, yeah, he's vulnerable to dying, <laughs> yeah, essentially, yeah. it's just four mana eight k, dies to crunch everything, yeah, to Odin's and yeah. Uh, Alicia. Searcher for a good type of card. Searcher for a typo. Yeah. It's interesting, yeah. it's all typo, not just the cadets. Yeah. And so like, a lot of the, um, the, I think, ice, the sea things. Yeah, but there's all the sea things. So there's earth ones, there's yeah. ice ones. Yeah. So there's a lot of stuff you can search around, not just the cadets. Though, of yeah. course, it does obviously down cadets. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. You're probably putting it in there. Yeah. And a lot of them have good specials. So just yeah. being able to go and well, get the relevant yeah. special to play at the time makes. Yeah, and colour fixing in three colour is really useful if you need like a fire card you just get the king to pit to play back up and then that, that really helps with that yeah, yeah. good point good point uh, Ico the good one and then we've had a lot of searches in this pack <laughs> this is like a fourth the searcher yeah fourth fifth searcher part of the FF9 engine really good card yep so MC yeah. play as long as drawing cards is good yeah which so, is pretty much always <laughs> yeah between that Steiner and Zidane it's just 
playing with it is just crazy, and even more to a lesser extent. Yeah. But you can sometimes ditch a mod if you're low space. Go, I don't really see it seeing much play. It's a two cost, but a legend one. Yeah. Summons, got, like pay, so break it to just get one of them. Get one yeah, back. Like there's lots of better effects. If you that. really need a weapon, you've already paid all three, maybe. Yeah, yeah, but, yeah. It's yeah. You want the chances of you not actually being. I suppose it sort of enables the mod turn two for the draw because it's like turn one you play like go turn two you play mod draw a card. Even that's not worth it. Do you want the searcher? Yeah. I think. Yeah. Unless you're not using the, the forwards and you just want that back a bit. If you're not going to use some forwards, I wouldn't play mod. Yeah. <laughs> I only, like, mod is less good than that Ico, in my opinion. Mm. You play yeah, the mod a, as an additional bonus. Balance, it? yeah, it's another balance, but as a free cost, he's, you're, it's a good when you have an Ico down. It's more like a one cost because you draw a card. Yeah. And then it's yeah, with the Ico down. Same cost so it's an occasion you can bounce. Yeah. yeah. That's, uh. And our hero. Oh, here we go. Oh, this guy. I kind of want to time. Special seems hard to use. What was the thing which deals a thousand to all forwards? Some so there's um uh, there's an ability um which on. deals one thousand to all forwards, not just the opponents. Oh yeah. And I think it was on a um. It's on a wind. Joseph Air video. Oh, an Earth card, sorry, isn't it? Yeah, I think so. I can't um, remember. I can't, can't remember what, what, which one it is, but it could make it usable because it hits all forwards for a thousand, yeah. and then you can quickly eat something. Um, on, unless you pin, pin it yourself, which isn't always the easiest. Yeah, and it's nice. There's a one cost seven k, which is yeah, nice. Yeah, I'm sure it's Earth because I thought oh, that's the other thing that's similar to that is um, video. Which... Yeah, really does damage everything. But you would kill Crypto. Is something which well, maybe it's fire because it's a fire. Sounds... I think it was a, it was a recent set. Um, I'm sure it's the new one, isn't it? One of the videos. Ah, something. Oh, someone said something. Someone said. I don't know. Pound more deals damage to all forwards. Synergize with Gogo. Uh, That's the one. Yeah. Sir. Yeah. So um. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. The yeah, back up. I just saw it. Yeah. 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 So that could be used to affect in earth water, but yeah, yeah, that seems a bit cute of the trombo. Yeah. It'd be diff- difficult. It'd be easy to get down because you can search for panel. Yeah. Um, but, but then it's a bit dry. Yeah. yeah I've I've not tried for a full set of Pelinor and yeah, Vandalis and that. the other backup, whatever its name is. They're p- potentially, yeah, because you can search for like any of them. Well, yeah. Search for Vandalis and that can search for the backup. And yeah. It's like an Earth engine. That's the one, yeah. Yeah, and... Yeah, and, and yeah, 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 yeah such a Vandalis, does you have the Dalu Trotter name as the... Yeah, so that can search uh, for... Wall of Final Fantasy IV. You can search for one of the backups yeah. and yeah. you're probably going to draw one of the other ones if you're playing three. So, yeah, that should um, be something to try. So he can become instantly a 9k brave first striker. Yeah. get cards back it, for his experts as well okay? any... uh, he gets plus one for each of the backups and then it, like, if you use an earth you probably use oh, an, so, yeah. an yeah. Yeah. So I was just yeah. thinking just the, the combination of those three cards only makes him 8k for the yeah. first like, like, which sort of Sephiroth you pay an 8 for so that makes but him that's also and back he's searched himself yeah. 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 It's, so he's it, kind of a three cost yeah. maybe in mono earth when you have all the room for these things along with yeah but I think I suppose it synergizes the ability yeah, because that means you can trade up with. It goes, yeah. yeah, it's effectively you can tell a ten k. Yeah, then. Uh, which is pretty good for five and experts. You get a card back to your yeah, other Because sense, he's yeah. the one things they're buffing are both backups. So you're less likely mm. to get blown out by something getting removed. Yeah, basically only Which is yeah, because that's the th- that's the thing there is like um, combos yes. like Lugia's the squirrel is very paranoid with playing him with like him. Blocking, yeah, killing one. Yeah, if that, 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 that had a Mumu in hand in that second game, it would have been yeah. Or the first game, when I bought up a Balfour, that would have been amazing. Yeah. Yeah, because that would be able to talk about it. Yeah. So, gentlemen, as of Tuesday, we are moving on to our new Ooh, Lag- ooh Laguna on Tarts. Well, yeah, on uh, you saw him in the last game, not yeah. <laughs> as it turned out. No, it's a good card. Good. Very good card, still. Yeah. Tell us something on how many has a lot of applications. There's lots of good scrolls. Often. Devout as well. It's yeah, um, yeah, it's, it's yeah you devout well. it in. You devout two of the free scrolls in. Yeah, yeah. We'll see. You play for quite a while. And you can get one of those just by taking part in any of our Final Fantasy events as of Tuesday, yeah. <laughs> uh, which we offer foils to the winner and runner-up. We might have yes. to start cutting back after. That's fair. I think <laughs> I think we got five wins, uh, five Tuesdays in this month, as well as a Saturday tournament. And there's only eight of those foils. That's so, fair. <laughs> you got to. We got to find a way to share them out, but we'll yeah. we'll we'll figure out. <laughs> Yeah, as long as you have the old hearts. They are just old hearts, so yeah. that's nice. I am hoping they do some promos, but not as many as they were doing. So the promos yeah. are nice to have something to Extra look for. Yeah. for yeah. 
Well, I think the issue, the reason we had so many was yeah. because, of course, we were the we were behind, the distributors were behind. Yeah. Uh, now we finally caught up, and we are oh, happy. Getting, back month, yeah, we're yeah. now getting a monthly and yeah. on time. We yeah. can now say, okay, we now settle yeah. into our new set. Yeah. yeah. I'll say, I'm, I think the onion eye promo, which was revealed, is beautiful. Yeah. Uh, cool. Which is net smells, I know, but we've seen Laguna for quite a few. Months. So I'm probably bring out some onion nights to make that card like, better. better and yeah. all like a, it's still a two dot taste, which is quite cross with a good enter field would be It'll be broken. Well great. not broken, but it'll be good. But it's a light card, so it should be quite hard to do. Yeah. Uh anyone interested in chat? Water Earth Knights with uh Brandellis and yeah, nice. Elita. Just for fun, wouldn't play it seriously myself. Yeah, it's still as possible. Water Water Earth is still a good combo, yeah. so it's still in a different way. Pretty big. Yeah. Damage proof, lots of things to Titan as well to protect things, so yeah, um, yeah, yeah good. I think Water Earth will continue being good in some form. Yeah. I've played it plenty of times, I've done decently with it. Yeah. Second tier, knife to regionals. I don't get top yeah. much, I just <laughs> get close. Yeah, don't, yeah, you get close, you don't quite. Yeah, same, just just same. Set, set, little, little much, little yeah, much. Second of the last two Tuesdays, <laughs> second in the over speed draft. <laughs> What's the term? Always the bridesmaids, never Yeah, bride. basically. Yeah. Well, consistent, yeah, it's, it's consistency, I'll take that at least, but. Yeah. Yeah, that's, that's the key thing, is that you're consistently <laughs> getting oh, good good targets. Yeah, so if Gene wins and I win, I made it second to den. You never know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, it could be all in the cards. For you. We'll see what happens. It's I know today was a bit of an interesting day. Just wind, wind ice has not been seen mm. at all, I don't think. No, there's always been two kind of... <laughs> Strange shots put together, but yeah. It was just me and you were just chatting on the Tuesday after your ice, and I was like, yeah. wind could work with this, so... I think we played the mirror, didn't we, with the, the wind ice, yeah. and... That takes a while as it well. It depends on who got the Kenry down first, yeah. pretty much. Yeah. Just... It stops everything else. Yeah. It's pretty beautiful, especially with people t- start to rely on silence too much. Mm. Just having to pay three more is just... Yeah. A bit thin. And having the seven as well to cancel... Like, seven and air lift to cancel effects on my specials as well is just... Mm. Yeah. And cancel so much. Save me a dent the Type Zero. I cancelled nine special. Yeah, <laughs> it's like oh, you have five yeah, forwards. Snake bite. Yeah. Okay. Okay, Where nice. did your construction of your decks come from initially? Well, that's it. I think I think both of them kind of food to Matt ice deck. Um, did you play on Tuesday? Yeah, I adapted the ice deck on Tuesday, which we won with. Um, because I wanted to use either ice wind or ice earth. I think we tried out the ice wind against you. Yeah, this week. Yeah. Um. And I felt there wasn't enough like t- things to block to be t- yeah. t- defensive. Um, okay. So I thought the earth because I wanted to be basically resistant to as many effects as as possible. So I wanted to play the Vincent, so you can't be broken. I wanted to play the Deleter, who's just like hard to shift anyway. I wanted to use Titan, so you can like stop stop things. I wanted to tricks like the Monk to like um, increase power. I wanted to be able to resist as much as possible, but also be aggressive with the uh, dining effects, which can also be d- defensive as well. Yeah. Um, yeah. I think I just work from there, really. Um, yeah. Always like Earth, nice. I think I try- tried to make an Earth Ice deck at the end of, at the st- start of it, Opus 2. I feel like this is kind of what I was aiming for then, but there wasn't enough to take it good. Yeah. 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 Like I said, I don't know. I'll say playing wind, I've always had a trouble with wind forwards. I never feel like we do enough a lot of the time. Mm. Yeah, they're, they're underpowered with some sort of tricks. Of yeah, kind, just not they? quite my style. So I think if I try out again, I may do more of the earth route. I probably would not do as dull heavy. Mm. Just, do, just more protections, more well, uh, good stuff. Well, Super Mike Nugget says if you go more mid range uh, with the ice wind, it's really powerful. Someone I did think of actually when I was building it was like, hmm, should I just go a bit more? Yeah. So I like, take out I take out the sevens then to say just pure defensive. Take out a few mm-hmm. other things, but I thought I'd build it up and I'd test it a bit. To get through with, um, train eight maybe. Yeah, be unlockable. Yeah, but yeah, I only have I only have one tray, so he's yeah. just doing it. He's tray is still good, and I think that more mid range you would. I uh, I don't know, wouldn't say better, but it would be definitely mm. yeah, different. Dead. Less we to add though, obviously. Yeah. But no, it's definitely another way. There's like so much unexplored space in Final Fantasy, though. We have still yeah. a growing player, player base, hopefully, but. Someone was mentioning about poss- the possibility of bringing in equipped cards and things. Item cards. Yeah, yeah, are they cards. confirmed for net set? Uh, not next set, no. I think. Mon- something's, something's yeah. net set. Monsters it's a monster's net set. set. Yeah. Yeah, just obviously. 
I don't know how much you know earlier, but uh, Final Fantasy was a card game in Japan for four, five years. Yeah, yeah. So, I, don't, yeah. I, know it's, I don't think that there has been. Yeah, and like exactly, yeah. 13, 14 sets at the very yeah. least in 12 chapters. Have, with, I think, the Warburton Eagle in, so that, that they haven't even worked it out. So, yeah. um, the, they had a small ban list. They banned a few cards, yeah. which I guess in there was quite overpowered. But. Yeah, or well, I think I had Strange Combos one I heard. I did look into it a bit, yeah. but yeah, they had chapters and they had item cards and monster cards, so I'd like to see different things. Come in, just more debt options are going to be good. Yeah. Final Fantasy, Final Fantasy doesn't have much combo based debt, so I'd say. It has tempo, mm. it has adro, it has control, doesn't really have combo, which is no. a shame, it's one of my favourite types in other games. Silly combos can be funny. Mm. <laughs> I suppose if they were to bring in, like, equipped cards which have items or other yeah. abilities and such, you could work on the whole comboing. And yeah, yeah, a little bit, but mm. yeah. That's something yeah. that's quite. We also had another element to that full deck building, so. The moment you've just got like, your forwards, your backups, your summons, if there's also equipment and oh, stuff, yeah, it's going to water yes. down what else to get yeah, like, mixed. I, say, I think a lot of the time in summons, maybe one's taking a hit. Yeah. Maybe, maybe a few less forwards and backups, but you need those to fight and to play cards. So I think yeah. summons are your luxury like flex slots a lot of the time. So that the water deck that <laughs> oh, yeah, that one. <laughs> Jamie built, um, because Nationals, is like 11 forwards yeah. or something. And I, I love the style of that deck when I saw the Opus 3 version yeah. of it and it has so much style, yeah. Loads of summons, like 11 or 12 forwards, whatever it was. Yeah. Someone like, someone to try, else. someone fun. Yeah. Definitely. But... It's very interesting, I'm not sure how it would work. <laughs> it, it worked. Yeah. It was decent summon. It's, it's, it's kind of like the sort of thing I was trying to do way back in Opus 1. Which yeah. Just heavy control. Yeah. Lots yeah. of backups and using Lulu to recycle them. Lulu. Just have very yeah. few Bad forwards. And yeah. One, yeah. At least, I don't remember our first games. I got dead out twice. In the first ever yeah, I think weekend we, tournament. I think we read a game as well, which pretty much went to deck out yeah yeah, yeah. i quickly yeah. found with that deck that the its main win condition was <laughs> without any yeah. nil cards yeah just doing a bit more damage on your opponent the deck yeah yeah and, and just kill everything so i don't think i even a, yeah. lot of people were, a lot of people were trying to use a lot of the water i don't think i even was i think you just did a slightly more damage to me and yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> deck me out by a couple of cards like, if i just attack once you'll deck first yeah, yeah. <laughs> so but yeah, yeah. Uh, we have a fun game sir mm. yeah, yeah. first iteration of water earth which i'll probably do back to it's still my favorite deck i think Auto off, bit of tedious combo if needed. Yeah. I was saying, the chat was saying, is there any water here today? I like, know he's playing water. No, yeah. 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 so. I haven't so, seen any, so. Yeah. And he did. So, anyway. but like I say, it's the six, six elements, there's plenty of choices. Yeah, yeah. So, plenty of choices, plenty of unexplored dead space. Like, yeah, there's yeah. some elements you just never see together, yeah. which I think could be good. Like, wind is a lot less. So, wind, water, sort of some results, which I like. Nice what do you think of the new Zidane in wind? I like it. Ish. <laughs> yeah. It works well with Chaos because you can discard their best forward before you play the Chaos. Yeah. But and the I, other I, ends are so yeah. good. That's the problem. Yeah, I don't know if you saw... I don't, don't know, no, did I play one? I think I just started a trouble. I played in that deck just so if I have a board they set up I didn't try and get rid of something dangerous in the hand like a Shantoto against Earth, for example. Yeah. I think it will go into that more slower control or pure discard yeah, deck. Yeah, just as choosing the discard... Um, is it makes it a lot more powerful. Turn one, it's kind of just dead, yeah. So yeah. that's a damn one of the first slots I may take out if I ever did a dead again. I don't tend to stay on the deck for too long. <laughs> yeah, I make a lot of decks. And yeah, it's around. Yeah, both deck builders at heart. Yeah. yeah, before Tuesday, I played two different games and I made up about seven decks every week yeah. <coughs> across these two games. So I have a busy Monday night usually. Mm. <laughs> yeah, that's good. Well, like I say there is so much options and yeah. it doesn't feel like even if things aren't quite as good as other things I don't think anything is just fundamentally oh, oh these are just bad cards yeah. you know, there's, a there's, 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 there's some out there but there's not many you could put things. together decks with you know all commons mm. oh yeah definitely be playable because the power yeah. level isn't yeah. ridiculously spiked towards essentially yeah. Yeah. Like like in, in this new set of like commons like yeah. devouts are common and they're getting a lot of play and Tamar is common you still, yeah. Well, yeah. I mean, you also have a legends. I wouldn't say some of the worst cards, but mm. definitely aren't the best cards in the set. For I mean, they, they usually do more extreme effects. Yeah, more yeah, interesting things. Good or extremely. It's been a bit extreme effects. I do want to see the new Eth's Death play. I, I want to see if that can work. Yeah. That would just wipe the field entirely yeah. of everything. Yeah. Well, play it similar to the Dolbo's Death, but just wipe the field instead of swarming yours. But yeah, I think yeah. that'll be fun. It probably have to be mono lightning because the toss is huge, like seven yeah, lightning. That's very expensive. Yeah, yeah. that's left of yeah. Heavy control, get a lot of backups. You need at least yeah. three, two, two cards and a uh, 
an extra yeah. so if you get or a full hand yeah. <laughs> would be the other way of doing it yeah that's kind of a problem you don't really want to be playing many backups yeah. but if you don't you have to have a full hand so yeah. lots of cheap backups and then just yeah uh, yeah which it can do like Lightning has a lot of good cheap backups yeah. like all four black mages can see play yeah it's good as well because it just sort of so we everything apart from X Death. Yeah, <laughs> you like, you have the advantage. You, you've got a forward. Everything else is gone. Yeah, and time and right and just be crushing. Right. Yeah. So I'd like to see well, possibly I'll possibly try myself one of these days if I have enough or yeah. someone else do well with that. So I think it definitely has possibilities. So, yeah. It's quite possible that we will probably see one of you back on the stream well, for our well, last game. I'm imagining maybe Gene, if you want to see the top well, two. We will probably <laughs> okay. do top table unless your parents want to be on the stream yeah, naturally. Yeah. Uh, which case would then go for Johnny's game. <laughs> well, and, uh, see, see if we can survive a bit longer. Yeah, see, see if we can actually see your deck. Get yeah. some, get <laughs> some players. Get, 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 get a field out. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah Adro was a. Like I said, any deck in farm fans, you can go for the Adro. Yeah. So that's why it's a good game where you don't have to get resources down. Yeah. You, if you don't want use them to be forward, so. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Definitely something, something better than wind dice, but mm. just messing with it and seeing. So, yeah. All right. Fair enough. <laughs> But yeah, I think the chat were very pleased with that display. <laughs> well, that's how it was. It was very different from our first game. Yeah, it was very, very quite long, didn't it? Yeah. Yeah, that's a lot more. New players are still kind of like yeah. learn the cards and the sets and stuff. It wasn't just that. It was. It long was long. that they were relatively new players. Yeah. Um, you know, they knew what they they knew what they were doing more or less. Mm. Um, whereas you guys, you got you know each other, <laughs> you know the yeah. cards yeah. by heart. You just boom, yeah, I know what that does. Yeah, yeah. I agree with this. Uh, yeah. To the break, to the break down or whatever. Yeah. <laughs> um, plus, because your game just went so conclusively <laughs> as well. Yeah. Once right. again, we didn't have to make too many tough decisions. It was like, yeah. okay, need, Dream was trying to tell me, Don't. I just need to try and survive. Yeah. That's yeah. Just see what we can do. Yeah. yeah whereas those games. I mean, we thought that Tom was going to run, run, run away with it when, in the end, it was actually Steve who clawed it back in mm-hmm. the end yeah. and uh, yeah. went yeah. on to win. <laughs> so, you had to watch back and see it, and if it was yeah. close to game, that's a nice sense. Yeah, it was, it was quite an interesting one. Um, yeah. Yeah. No, I won't tell you <laughs> all about it if you're going to watch it back. But, yeah. Uh, it was, yeah, it was pretty going on there and back and forth and... Yeah. People are, I'm gonna love that video on YouTube. Ten minutes, love that video. Ten minutes, then forty minutes of us discussing the game. Yeah. <laughs> nice and easy. Yeah. It's fine. But yeah, um, no, no. Are you pleased with your performances overall today in your two games so far? First game was so far, yeah. yeah. Like first game against Type Zero, like on first zero test and Type Zero just ran over it. So yeah. Adam and new fins definitely helps. I'm glad. I don't address one weakness if not all of them. I think. No. Our games are finished, and nice. the next awesome. round might be coming through. The next rounds, no, 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 no. Just, just a random start. Just now a random, <laughs> random Chris appears. <laughs> he does that every now. And then. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> he does that. This is my office. It should be secluded away from everyone <laughs> else. But us. I, people send to come through here every yeah. now and then. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Perkins, Zeal, yeah. Um, what do you guys think of us streaming? Final Fantasy regularly. Uh, I like it. The it's only good. yeah, the only slight downside is having a slightly smaller player base, unfortunately. But yeah. that needs to be done. If we can, hopefully it'll grow. Yeah, hopefully grow. Hopefully maybe get a rotation so Dad can still play some games. I'm just and I know because I, when I did Dice Masters, I, I was sitting here thinking I wish I had to play. Mm. Yeah, <laughs> sad but so, true. Yeah. It's sad but true. I mean, yeah. it's a, it's kind of like the chicken and the egg. Whereas you want to grow the community, and the best way to grow the community is Dead get the game out. Yeah. 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 But then it requires you at least having two people sit yeah, back, two people. or at the very least one, yeah, okay. but and to do commentary. Yeah, um, it's definitely needed. Yeah, how are you finding uh, Final Fantasy? Because I know you haven't really played before, but like watching it, seeing how it works. It's awesome. interesting. I've played a game with Gary. <laughs> you did your test day. I did terribly, <laughs> um, <laughs> but it gave me a good gra- grasp of the least the basics of the game. Um, and it was very different to Magic yeah. and to Dice Master as well, which you yeah. know I've played yep. as well. Um, so yeah, I'm not really a, a card game player, but it was nice. It was a nice change of play- pace yeah. compared to Pokemon and, yeah. and yeah, Pokemon's a very different one again. Yes, yeah, I played too many games. I think that's what makes <laughs> Pokemon Magic and Final Fantasy so, even Yu Gi Oh to an extent. Oh, Yu Gi Oh is different to the other three again. Like, is, yeah, they're all <laughs> very different in the way they play. They have similar elements, yeah. but they, the way the mechanics yeah. work together, are very different. Mm. Well, yeah. Yes, if you break it down, it's cards attacking cards. Yeah. But that's at a really basic yeah. level. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. yeah, so I mean, there's a lot of the basic rules are very similar to magic. Yeah. yeah. 
but yeah, even just slight tweaks, like I was yeah. saying when we were watching one of those games earlier, the, the fact that you can party attack and only single block, which yeah. is basically the reverse of magic, where yeah, you yeah. can double block but not sing, yeah. you know, it's all single attacking, just changes the whole dynamic of you know yeah. the advantage effectively then lying with the attacking player as opposed to the defending player. Yeah. And it just changes yeah. the whole way the game's played. Not yeah. to mention the fact that, you know, Turn one in magic is land, maybe something. Yeah, yeah. Well, it can be nothing. Two, two nine like days. Two, the whole hand goes. <laughs> yeah. And, yeah, yeah. It just go versus delete. You can get like five fours on the field and yeah, back in like yeah, yeah, crazy. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. Um, so I think, yeah, I think the damage changes things a lot. If yeah. that it's like uh, destroyed damage instead of more powerful card does more damage. Mm. Makes a lot more of a tempo game almost than a lot of magic mm. games. Yeah, because magic you can get some bit out or you can do a big combos with just one hit, but. Final Fantasy really can't do that, yeah. apart from occasionally with a Tidus deck, which I have tried. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Sometimes well, Tidus with a new Dart Summon is funny, but mm. not quite to convey it. <laughs> but yeah, it almost feels like playing this and playing Pokemon, the tempo matters a lot more, because in Pokemon, you have to try and get things set up and try and keep yeah. the tempo of your deck going almost. And if you get stuck, it's really bad. The same with Final Fantasy, if you start getting bogged down, you just lose the tempo and lose your games. Yeah. On a magic one bit card can swing it a lot easier. Like Magic and Force yeah. of Will, which I play. Yeah, it, it's. Um, there's a lot more. Well, I mean, it's. Yeah, a lot of it is there's a lot more cards because it's been yeah. going for a lot longer. Yeah. But yeah. But to be fair, how many sets are in standard for Magic? No more than like six, isn't it? You know, up to eight. Eight. Four, yeah. Four, four to eight as it rotates. Yeah, so. I'm um, um, up to three now, all of them being decently large sets. Yeah. I mean, the first one was huge. We've been about 200 cards in a set. It's massive. Yeah, I think yeah. for starters, then 148. Second and third plus yeah. more sizes. So a decently sized set. So yeah, mm. yeah. yeah. No, it's certainly. Like I have like said it's it's different enough to magic to make it. Into yeah, game, but definitely. Familiar enough that yeah. Like, yeah. the rules carry over a lot of time. Like right, I remember. The basics. Yeah, when we when we first started, everyone was assuming when we didn't say something in the start of the set, magic rules applied. Yeah, pretty much every time. Yeah, so, basically true. <laughs> yeah. And it is, yeah. They got the, finally got the comprehensive rules out, which is nice. Yes. Yeah. Don't have to rely on tweets. No. There's also the um, X-Burst system as well, yeah. and also just the, the effect of like a card being put in, yeah. in damage, which at the moment you can't get that back. So if you lose, yeah. say, like a second of a card you've got in the deck, you know you're not going to see it again. Yeah. So, um, yeah, so that exactly. also can be... Yeah, damage down there, but X-Burst as well, didn't it? Very almost, I haven't played too much of it, but Vandal style feel. Mm. Where stuff going in there can really make a big difference on the day and change things entirely. So mm. dealing with damage is not always an obvious thing. You may not always want to go all out even if you've got the advantage. It's one big yes, but you should just lose so much. Yeah. Imperishable knights that he likes uh, how fast FFTCG is. It can be. Yeah. So. Some games just go on a while. <laughs> yeah, you can like, can't can sell it. Like, I think it's more yeah. about how, you know, as you say, you can mm. discard into yeah. my hand and get some you cards in immediately. Yeah. You don't yeah. have to spend time you, or you can spend time getting resources, but you don't have to. Yeah, yeah. which is nice. Um, there's no build up, you can just go ham. Uh, yeah, there's also a question here for like, East Coast and Mike P uh, to debate for everyone. Opus 3, Delisa, fair or unfair? Uh, fair, I'd say. It's easy enough to get around. Um, yeah, there's a lot of board wipe effects, a lot of things. Yeah. yeah, and you could just. Combat, is, uh, yeah, Zalera. Yeah, you've got something bigger about it. Just yeah. 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 You've got some, like, Zalera, Shantoto, the new door and just doesn't care. Quite Cyclops, a few small things. Tello. Yeah. There's a lot of things which can deal with it. Um, yeah. So. It's a good card, like Dondal as well. Yeah. It is a really good card, but it's a five cost. It's uncursed, hard to remove. Yeah. But it's the same as Kuja, like you can kill it, you just, have, you just have to pay the cost. Yeah. And one damage, especially if you don't against that kind of deck where the leader fits in a slower deck. Yeah. Sometimes you don't care about taking out one damage yeah. just to get rid of it with. Yeah. Like, so if you're annoying if they then use yeah. the Titan or whatever, because then you. Yeah. So, yeah, it's still there. Take a damage for nothing. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. so. So yeah. It's undoubtedly powerful, but yeah. I don't think oh, yeah. it's fundamentally broken. Yeah. No. And plus, it is another deleter, and their free cost deleter is still, yeah. in my opinion, one of the best things enough. They had to break your own back of death event defense well. again, yeah. being a 9k as well, with an S. That deleter is still one of the best cards, and sharing yeah. a name does make it a bit awkward. But you can easily s- see it being like a 2 1 split. 2 1 2 2, two, two, two splits. I think I tied in their deck. So, yeah. I- Has anyone ever activated his special? Yeah, once, once I think, once or twice. <laughs> yeah, not I often. Just because I happen to have one in hand, I was like, yeah, oh, I can use that. that. Yeah, yeah. once or twice. I guess yeah. I just play very defensive decks. So yeah. yeah. It's well, usually... I don't attack unless they're going to fall, isn't it? Yeah. yeah, if they block and they put <laughs> combat trick, it can occasionally be yeah. useful, but it's not something you play for. Yeah, yeah. I suppose they've got to have something that... Really like unless they've got something really big and using it with a new... 
if you sink, you can maybe combo off a little forced block to destroy the blocker. Yeah, and sometimes it just need damage if they're stared at the special. Like, yeah. even if you never activated it, it's having the special. It means you leave one earth up, one one card in hand, and they're stared to block them everything. As you can you search for a knight, so you can always have it on, on field, and then search for another one, and then be like, I've got another in hand, and yeah. they're going to know you can Wait, whatever they block it. So yeah, 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 something little. So you leave them yeah. with not much choice. It's kind of like for a no in that sense, where if you block yeah. it, you don't want to block it, so you take them damage. Yeah. Like even though it is almost unblockable in certain situations, mm-hmm. that's what they do it. Just yeah. they can't not block it, just they die, so they have to let it through. Mm-hmm. So that's why it's being very fun and nice base aggro lists. We've been playing a lot of ice recently, actually. Yeah. Like I said, I think it's one this of is, them. This is good. Yeah, one of the more powerful, especially recently, very powerful effects. So. so I mean, naturally, people's, opinion, people's opinions are people's opinions, but yeah. East Coast Mike P says that one of his friends or one of the friends that he plays with. Hates it because his views, he views it as it punishes you for playing properly. Uh, Perish for like counters with it to punish you for not being flexible. Yeah. It's probably the best option. Mm. Let's play um, around it. Yeah. yeah. As with all things, you know, when you're aware of what cards exist, you have to be prepared to face them, have an answer to it. Yeah. Uh, we have pairings. Same we do. Um, so Jordan and Jean are more than happy, well, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> happy to go on the feature table. Jordan certainly is. And obviously you guys are like the top of the table, so that's kind yeah. of the feature event. Well, I think it makes sense that we see that. Yes, in absolutely. Play. So good yes. luck to you. Yep. And everyone enjoy the match. I'll try not to. Thank you very much. Thank you for coming in. Yep. All right.